Qatar is one of the richest places in the world. The richest men in Qatar, therefore, are some of the wealthiest men anywhere in the world. Naturally, many people want to know those who make up this list because they have learned about the carefree lifestyles of the billionaires in the desert. A person with a keen understanding can further gain insights into the business terrain in Qatar. By following the money, one can detect economic opportunities while it is still early. In today's video, we will be showing you the top 10 richest people in Qatar. Without further ado, let's begin. 10. Khalid bin Hamad Al Thani Khalid bin Hamad Al Thani is a member of the ruling Al Thani family. However, he is famous as Qatar's number one drag racer. Aside from being a drag racer, he is the main figurehead as the country attempts to become a major Formula One and drag the racing ground. He has invested huge amounts of his personal money to stage international car racing events, and he is known as the patron sheikh of racing in Qatar. Sheikh Khalid is the owner of Al Anabi Racing. He is an avid car lover and has been known to splash huge amounts of cash on exotic automobiles. 9. Khalid bin Hamad bin Abdullah Al Thani Khalid bin Hamad bin Abdullah bin Jassim bin Mohammed Al Thani is a former Minister of Interior of Qatar, a position he held from 1972 to 1989. He is the son of Sheikh Hamad bin Abdullah Al Thani. His grandfather practically built the country. He has diversified investments in real estate, hospitality, and various other sectors. Some of his sons control his businesses and interests. 8. Sheikh Faisal Qasim Faisal Al Thani Sheikh Faisal Qasim Faisal Al Thani is one of the wealthiest men in Qatar because of his vast holdings in real estate and the hospitality industry. He is currently the chairman of the Al Faisal Holding Company, which is one of the biggest conglomerates in Qatar. As a businessman, his knowledge is impeccable. He founded his business in the year 1964 and has gone on to own more than 20 international hotels around the world. He started by selling car parts at an age of 16 and gradually progressed to getting distributorship deals with foreign automakers. 7. Wissam Al Mayna Wissam Sal Al Mayna is the chairman of the Al Mayna Group, which is a conglomerate based in Qatar that has diversified investments. His businesses include activities in automobiles, services, real estate investments, food and beverages, engineering, technology, and media. He is one of the best known businessmen in the country. He became famous for his marriage to Janet Jackson in 2012, although the couple got separated in 2017. 6. Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani was born on 3 June 1980. He is the Emir of Qatar, as the absolute monarch of the country. He is the most powerful man in the land. He is the fourth son of the previous Emir, Hamad bin Khalifa, and he ascended the throne in 2013 when his father abdicated the throne. Since ascending the throne, he has taken steps to raise Qatar's international profile through hosting sports events, as well as diversifying the state investments in the area of industries, tourism and sports. He has been keen on buying profitable football clubs all over the world. Even though he does not directly control any of the investment funds, it is clear that he is the one that signs off on all policies, and anyone who does not follow orders is removed from office. 5. Hamid bin Jassim bin Jabir Al Thani Sheikh Hamid bin Jassim bin Jaber bin Mohammed bin Tani Al Thani was born on the 11th of January 1959. He is a very influential Qatari politician and diplomat. He was the Prime Minister of Qatar from 3 April 2007 to 26 June 2013 and Foreign Minister from 11 January 1992 to 26 June 2013. For most of that time, he was both Prime Minister and Foreign Minister. He is a member of the Al Thani family. His grandfather was the younger brother of the man who built the country. 4. Akbar Al Baker Al Baker is one of the most influential and powerful men in Qatar. He is currently the group CEO of Qatar Airways. Akbar Al Baker has had a very glorious career developing the aviation industry of Qatar from scratch. He was one of the lead developers of the Hammond International Airport, which opened in 2014. He is also one of the key people behind the development of the tourism industry in Qatar. In May 2021, Al Baker was appointed as chairman of One World. Akbar Al Baker was born in Qatar, but grew up in India. Upon his return to Qatar, he was immediately tasked with working on the long-term development goals of the country. He has been in the Civil Aviation Directorate of Qatar, Chairman of the Qatar Tourism Authority, as well as CEO of several important companies in Qatar, including 
Qatar Duty Free Company, Qatar Aircraft Catering Company, and Qatar Aviation Services. 3. Sheikh Ahmed bin Said Al Maktoum Sheikh Ahmed bin Said Al Maktoum was born on 1 December 1958. He is one of the richest men in Qatar, and as a member of the Dubai ruling family, he is believed to be one of the world's wealthiest royals. Presently, he holds the position of president of the Dubai Civil Aviation Authority. He is also the CEO and founder of the Emirates Group, as well as chairman of Dubai World. He is also the chairman of Noor Takaful Insurance Company. He is the current chancellor of the British University in Dubai, which is the Middle East's first research-based postgraduate university, and he is the chairman of the Dubai Supreme Fiscal Committee. Aside from being one of the wealthiest, Sheikh Ahmed bin Said Al Maktoum is also one of the most powerful people in Qatar. 2. Saad Shirad Al Kabi Saad Shirad Al Kabi is a veteran in the oil business. He is currently the Minister for Energy in Qatar, as well as the President and CEO of Qatar Petroleum. He joined the oil company back in 1986 while he was still at university. He started at the Reservoir and Field Development Department of the company and then held several positions along the line. On his way to attaining one of the most impressive resumes in the oil industry that you can find in the whole of Qatar. Al Kabi is also the chairman of Industries Qatar, large cooperation that acts as a holding company, directing several of the Emirates' industrial efforts. Some of the company's products include petrochemicals, steel, and fertilizers. He is also chairman of Gulf Drilling International and Adriatic LNG Terminal, which are offshore exploration companies. 1. Sheikh Abdullah bin Mohammed bin Saad Al Thani Sheikh Abdullah bin Mohammed bin Saad Al Thani is the richest man in Qatar. He has a long and illustrious career in business and diplomacy. He currently serves as the Qatari ambassador to Germany, a position he has held since appointed in August 2020. Before then, he was chairman of Urdu Kuwait and served as president and commissioner of Indeset Urdu. He transformed Urdu from a one-country telecom operator to a group, with a presence in 10 countries. He also served on the ITU Broadband Commission for Digital Development. In this capacity, he helped chart the course of development of digital technology in Qatar, and ultimately the region. He was a member of the World Bank Group Advisory Council for Gender and Development. Sheikh Abdullah bin Mohammed bin Saad Al Thani was also a chief executive officer of Qatar Investment Authority from 2014 to 2018. That position put him in charge of one of the world's largest sovereign wealth funds, where he moved to diversify the investments not just in market sectors, but also in the countries where the investments are held. So guys, let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. For more interesting content, give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to the channel for more awesome content. Have a nice day and I will see you in the next video.